I'm here on the Gold Coast right in the heart of Broadbeach at a truly unique restaurant called Moo Moo's Wine Bar and Grill which is literally minutes away from Jupiter's Casino so it's the perfect place to come and have a pre-concert dinner or a cocktail after the show. Now the lights are definitely a trademark at Moo Moo's. Owners Stephen and Autumn Adams have created lights that fascinate their diners because they change colour and patterns to suit every occasion. with Damien, the head chef at Moo Moo's. Thank you for talking to us. Not a problem, anytime. Now, do you have any particular influences on your menu? Uh, there's a little bit of Asian, a little bit of European. Uh, a lot of it is what I like to eat as well. Yeah. But it's just a broad spectrum, hoping that every, anyone that comes in is going to find something that they're going to like to eat. Absolutely. And I'm sure there is something right in front of us that everyone would like to eat. Can you uh, tell us what's here? Hopefully. Uh, Right here we have a Roma tomato and Italian buffalo mozzarella salad uh, with fresh picked basil, a 25 year old aged balsamic and uh, Joseph's olive oil. Yep. Uh, to our other entree, sorry, over to the right is a Harvey Bay scallops pan seared with roasted pork belly and Asian ginger salad. Fantastic. Uh, just behind it is our South Australian rack of lamb with braising uh, lamb juices. Uh, braised lamb shoulder and porcini mushroom pativier, uh, leek and onion puree and confit cherry tomatoes. Gorgeous. Uh, to the centre is our piece de resistance, uh, the master kobe with uh, pickled ginger, uh, some daikon, some wasabi infused Japanese mayonnaise and ponzu. Yep. Uh, the master kobe is licensed uh, to us only in Australia, we're one of the only places that you can like get this on a regular basis. Wow, that's good to know. Uh, to the front we have our Moo Moo chocolate variation, which is a soft centered chocolate pudding, a flourless chocolate and orange cake with double cream coffee anglaise, and a chocolate and blackberry ice cream. Well, that sounds fantastic. I'm here with the owner of Moo Moo, Stephen Adams. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Fine, thank you very much. Now to say that you have a lot of wine is a complete understatement after seeing that wine wall. Yes, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> but can you select just a few of them to go with some of the meals that we've just seen? Of course, of course. We've got a couple of dishes of, obviously that you've seen. Um, first wine would be um, a couple of wines I've picked out here. The Dry River Pinot from Mardenborough in New Zealand. It's a fantastic Pinot, it's one of my favourites. It goes great with our duck dish. Um, low, low yielding vines and a cool maritime climate really produce a fantastic Pinot and um, I absolutely adore this one although you can't get too much of it so I wish I could get some more. But. Absolutely. Uh, moving on we have the Rockford Basket Press which I'm sure many people will have heard of so although, although once again it's uh, very hard to find wine it's a fantastic wine another of my personal favourites. Okay. Um, it's from the Barossa Valley it's a Shiraz um, it suits our Wagyu and our Kobe beef fantastically. Um, it's a big old fashioned red and it really cuts through the, the meaty, steaky taste and the fat and the, really gives you a smile on your face when you're having your meal, so it's fantastic. So. Yeah. Um, on, to, on to the whites, probably I should have started the, with the whites, but um, we have our Hugo from um, the Pinot Gris from Alsace in France. Um, it's a dry white Pinot Gris, it goes great with our scallops and our pork belly. And um, this is actually from um, France's driest, um, driest wine region, producing region. So it's a fantastic, um, fantastic wine. I really enjoy this wine. And it's one for sort of lazy afternoons as well and a few bottles with friends and you can really enjoy it that way. So. And um, a few unique wines here really. And uh, moving on to our last one, which is quite the Antonori Savaro della Sala from Italy. It's, um, it's, it's a, a yeah, it's, it, it is. <laughs> it's a Chardonnay from Italy, as I said. It's beautiful Italian wine, and it really suits our Italian dish, sort of Italian style dish, I should say, yep. which is our Italian buffalo mozzarella salad. And it, it's a great wine with that as well. So. Fantastic, thank you for that. So there's a wine for every every dish. Yes, certainly is. Fantastic, thanks, Stephen. 
Well, I can certainly see why there's so many celebrities going there. The place looks glamorous. Absolutely. Now, actually, while I was at Moo Moo's, Elvis Presley's best man walked in. Are you serious? I am serious. I didn't get a chance to talk to him, though. He ran away before I got to say anything. How did you know it was his best man? Did he have oh, a I'm Elvis. Ah, oh, OK. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I, I believe them. Now, yeah. after the break, we're staying in Broadbeach to go in search of that perfect coffee. So stay tuned. Thank you very much.